More than 10 hours after the blackout began, authorities announced that electricity had been restored to several areas of Hartsfield Jackson Atlanta International. Georgia Power said on its Twitter page late on Sunday that power was back in the airport's atrium and several concourses. The utility said earlier it expected power to be fully restored by midnight. Passengers at the airport were left in the dark when the lights went out at around 1 p.m. local time. The outage halted all outgoing flights, and arriving planes were held on the ground at their points of departure. International flights were being diverted, officials said. Mayor Kasim Reed tweeted Sunday night that all passengers had been safely deplaned. The city of Atlanta said it would provide shuttle service to the Georgia Convention Center for travelers in need of a place to stay. Delta passenger Emilia Duca, 32, was on her way to Wisconsin from Bogota, Colombia, when she got stuck in Atlanta. A lot of people are arriving, and no one is going out. No one is saying anything official. We are stuck here, she said. It's a nightmare. Hartsfield Jackson, which serves 104 million passengers a year, is the world's busiest airport, a distinction it has held since 1998. The airport serves an average of 275,000 passengers daily, according to its website. Nearly 2,500 planes arrive and depart each day.